We all know that Andrew Tate has been arrested and is currently behind bars. But did you know he's been sent to hospital? And fans all over the place are coming up with all sorts of theories like First, this one. They silence your voice, i.e. cancel. Second, they put you in jail, i.e. cancel your freedom. And if that doesn't work, well, you know the rest. Mm, I really don't. They cancel your life, you idiot! But our favorite theory involves science and cloning. Some say this is the perfect opportunity to clone Tate. And if you think there's a far-fetched story, Check out what Kid Boo has to say about the subject he claims to be a second generation clone. Through clones and transfer our consciousness. I'm in living proof now. Shout out Clone Aid. So what happened with my first gen is they took the skull he initially had written in a will uh, to the railing movement that if something were to happen to him, they can ship the skull over immediately to Clone Aid so they can remove a fragment of bone that's located here. And in this fragment of bone, it stores all of your memories and consciousness. And with that, they can make a sufficient replica of yourself, a reproductive version of you, including your memories. And you can be selective as to which ones you keep or don't keep. And this process has been around for quite some time. Like Dolly the Sheep was cloned back in, I think, the late 70s early 80s if I'm not mistaken. Could this mean that Andrew Tate when he comes out of jail will be a different person, an entirely new clone? Do you believe in cloning and what are your thoughts on this situation?